weekly vlog, starting this one in Amsterdam. Whoa! So I've come to Amsterdam for the for the night, for an evening, to, uh, because I'm I'm here for an event. I have mentioned it previously on in a vlog, but if you didn't know already, I am. I've I've been asked to be an ambassador for Specsavers, which is wild. All because. This all started back when I got some new glasses at the beginning of the year and I posted this picture on Instagram and um, my TikTok of my new glasses and they were like, we'd love to work with you. And I think that's, that is the epitome of, of starting an organic relationship with a brand, isn't it? It's big news, it's great news. Like I've got an ambassadorship role. I'm here with them because they've got a very exciting launch and I'm gonna goose it. Do you know what I think's wild is the fact that I can get to Amsterdam from mine in less time it takes me to get to London. Got a tram into town to go to the Hoxton Hotel, not realising there was two Hoxtons. I just wrote the Hoxton in on City Mapper, went to the wrong one. So I had to get a cab to so the correct one. But it's alright. I mean, I'm a little bit. Uh, there's not much going on, on around in this area, but this hotel was bigger and it's got loads like, really cool. Apparently, it used to be an old children's prison. <laughs> So is that why you sent me here? It's funny because I've just painted my kitchen orange and I've just and my hotel room is, is a lovely orange. But look, it's really cool. It's like a little like almost like a loft room. Love the panelling, love the colours, love this. But then also, what's quite cool is the bathroom is oh I've got the separate toilet. That's good, I suppose, isn't it? If you share a room with someone. And this is the outfit. So I've got my loose in yet corduroys on, some cowboy boots. I've got my shirt on from Asda, an All Saints jacket, my loose in yet cap, Ray Bans, rings. It's a nice selection of different <laughs> types of fashion, I suppose. Keeping it balanced. Um, I'm just deciding though whether to hat or not to hat. Because that, I don't know, I could give my hair a brush and go hatless, but what if it rains? I just had lunch at the hotel restaurant, La Brasserie. It was delicious, Caesar salad, some chippies, and uh, I had a little cocktail, it was called a slap and pickle. It was a gin cocktail with pickle brine. Sounds rank, doesn't it? But it was superb. Very good brownie. Mm. Yum. I got absolutely drenched. So I left the event, I come to somewhere to get some food. It's a good event. <coughs> I, I stuck around, hung out with the peeps there. But anyway, they were all going for dinner. They did invite me, but I was like, it's okay. Because it was quite far out where they were going for dinner. And I just want to eat so quick and go back to the hotel, basically die and sleep. I would come to the living room place that me and Connor came to back in February when we came to Amsterdam to see ways of play. And I've got a chicken wrap. I love Lebanese food. I can't wait for I got a drink. I, I'm so wet. I only bought one set of clothes. Not like this. I bought a change of top, but I've only got one pair of trousers and my one jacket. So if there's a radio in my room, it's going on there. And I'm back at the La Hotel. I just had a shower and washed my hair. I wasn't planning on washing my hair, but if you saw the size of this shower head up there, that's that's large. And the pressure of it was amazing. I was like, I need to be underneath. I need to be underneath that. I need to be underneath that shower. So I was like, okay, they've got shampoo and conditioner. I'm gonna do it. I came back to the hotel and this is what we're doing now. I'm going to bring my boyfriend, see how he is, see how the dogs are, and um, get myself some sleep. It was a really gorgeous event. Oh my God, it felt so fancy and lovely and the glasses were lush and everything was nice. Everybody was really nice. Got myself some shade, a goodie bag with some, some bits in. The sunglasses, so they have the rose 
detailing on it, inspired by Flower Bomb, the perfume. Very cool, very cool. We have them also in a clear. These aren't from my prescription, but they are just for styling purposes. And then we have the green ones, which I love. These are the green ones. Very fun. Yeah, they're so cool. And they've got even bigger, got like rose detail in the other side. Phone call, bedtime. See you in the morning. I'm home. Christ on a bike. I mean, my period started two days ago, but it's been really delayed with the cramps. And when I was on the plane home from Amsterdam, they whipped my ass. Danny, bless her, picked me up. Cause she lived around the corner from me. We live around the corner from the airport. So she picked me up first thing. Cause I landed at like half eight. Dropped me home. I ran a hot bath. Saved my life. I've just been running some errands anyway this morning. I got no food in, cause I ate it all. So I've got a bread sauce sandwich. And it's just, oh, it's delicious. This is a smoked chicken salad. I'm just gonna sit here for a bit. Have a little break, maybe a little nap. And then I'm, um, I'm wait, waiting for phase two to kick in. Phase two is basically where I just find that I get loads of stuff done in the morning, then I crash throughout the afternoon, and then phase two kicks in late afternoon, evening, or from late afternoon, and I'm just like full of it again. Phase two we, is pending. I got it. I got it. So this art print is the art print that spurred this whole idea of painting my kitchen orange albeit i love that word albeit i was thinking of going like more this kind of orange at first but i didn't want it to be too too i don't know i just saw this one and was like that's the one this is the orange but you know with the blue and the orange up against the fridge i think it just works so well because i just saw that i was like my smeg is basically that light blue and then i got that art print from austin i just think this all works really well this day has been um um a a oh gosh uh, a funny old one i've been rest i've been um after lunch i have to pop back into the city because my boyfriend needed to go to the apple store i picked up some leggings from h&m and a little fleece food shop and I've had another bath. My water bill is going to be mad and my heating bill is going to be mad. But this period is bad. This is a bad period. <sighs> I fucking I love this kitchen. I'm going to be doing a proper video though about the kitchen when I like proper, proper makeover style video. So stay tuned. That will be coming soon. Anyway. Apologies on today being a bit of a write-off. We will we will resume vlogging tomorrow, where I will be a much better. I will should be in much better state <laughs> of mind. <laughs> I'll make a cup of tea and I'll go to bed. Good morning. Last Thursday and strength session at the gym. I'm test driving a very exciting new product for my shop. I'm doing it in a beanie. It also is going to come in black. But I love this biscuit, this colour. She's trying out different leggings this week, which she's borrowed off Lily. Wait, the leggings, what? There's a matching. Set. Oh my god. Well, I Oops. <laughs> so she's testing out various different branded leggings to ask them for your birthday, right? Yes. And I think these are the winners. What brand is that? I don't know. Let me check my booty. Adanola. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think they're my favourite so far. Stunning. Okay. They'll be going on the birthday list. Birthday Thanks list. Also. Oh. oh. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Let's have a little look. See. Oh my God. she lifts in. Well, what's gonna? That's hard. That one. Let's try this one. Let's try this one. 
<laughs> the coffee is in shot. No. No. The booty shot. Go, go. <laughs> Lol. Funny times. That was good. Nice little strength session. Thursday morning. Go, go home and get ready. Bit of okay go. I've got to go to the hairdressers this morning. I feel like when I get in, I'm going to hairdressers this morning because I'm going to go look at hair extensions. Oh, they all fell out. I changed shampoo and they all fell out. I was like, ain't no point me going back again. A, it's not my hairdresser's fault. And it's not fair for her to spend her time putting them back in. And B, also, I hope this... Like when they fell out was like three weeks ago, I was like, oh, I can, I can wait. It's not the end of the world. Why is it though? Your hair looks really great just as you're about to go get I mean, I'm getting it done, but before you get hairdressers, your hair, the day you go to the hairdressers, your hair looks amazing. Or well, the couple of days before, you're like, I really like my hair at the minute. And then it, yeah. Oh wow. Emma's rectangle shop mug. Mug of positivity. Beautiful mug from Project Me shop. Anyway, I have food prepped lunches for the next two days. We've got chicken with Nando's garlic rub on it. We've got, this one is like a coconut and lime rice. That's a garlic rice. We've chopped up salad. There's a bit of tomato, lettuce and avocado. And then, oh, <laughs> yeah. One thing that is very adorable is that my boyfriend has put out my lunch already because I don't like things at fridge temperature when I'm about to eat it. So he's just got it out so it shouldn't be too, too cold. Of course, it's got it's covered in pairing hairs because it always is, all the time. Oh, here, here they come. Did you like the salad? Yeah, I love it. Saucy sauce is amazing as well. I can't believe it's called saucy sauce. What? I can't believe it's called saucy sauce. What is it? Ketchup and... Yeah, Why don't you just do that with mayo and ketchup at home? Because they know the perfect mixture of the bread. Okay. Tonight we are having stir fry. Lovely. The football is on. I have tanned and tidied the house. So I have less to do tomorrow. Because my friend Marika's coming to visit. And um, we're going to have a lovely weekend. Um, I'm making a little itinerary so everybody is on the same page. I say everybody. So my boyfriend knows what's going on. And doesn't keep asking me. He needs to know. I'm going to be making a little video um about my weekend like a little norridgey guesty sort of vibe um and there's my to-do list for the morning gotta be on track be on gotta get it out of the brain and onto paper because i'll go mad if not so i've tanned tonight i've tanned tonight and I'm using the um, Sandra Pay Express, right? And I really like it because it dries so quickly. Like, I'm not sticky at all. So I've just been bezing around the house doing housework, putting things away, and I've not been worried. I've been so desperate to turn this week. I hate being pale. Anyway, I've got my. Oh no! Mini Magnum, my fucking iPad's got 2% battery. I'm gonna have to sit where you're sitting. No, it's a hard time. I've got a knee injury. Please. Yeah, oh, in two minutes. In two minutes. Half time is. Morning, it's Friday. Oh my gosh, I just realised I look like 
Thelma from Scooby Doo. The green and the glasses and the orange hair. Did you have orange hair? I, I, I slept through my alarm. Today hasn't started as intended, but it's okay, really. I'm going to the tip and then Tesco because we're out of milk. Today and it's been real nice. Mm. We've been vlogging on my for 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 the other video that I'm making, so you'll have to watch that one. But it's a bit strong, though, isn't it? I'm such a small. Oh, yeah, it's beautiful. It's really good. <coughs> so we, um, we went into the city. I took her around. Where did we go? Mm. We went to the market for uh, for food. Amazing, for food. most amazing sandwich. Yeah. What was it again? Bodega. Christmas? Bodega. It was bodega, but it was a Christmas chick fried chicken sandwich. Mm -hmm. It was really we good. We got it. All mm. over. Oh, it was amazing. And yeah. then um, we just walked around some of the shops. You got a nice new coat. I got a new coat and that one warehouse. We went to the Lucy Act shop. Yes, we did. Nearly bought everything. But yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yeah, we went to this little, little like, it's like basically it's called Gar and Gimble. Mm. It's a gin shop, but they also sell lots of other yes. alcohol. And they were doing these Christmas crackers okay. with these little see. margaritas. In. And I've, I, I mean, I love the can. It's so cute. It's so so cute. I, I just made it into a little flower pot, um, which I'll put on here. Oh, and where did we go? I broke it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> we went through the arcade, which which arcade. was very Christmassy. I love the tiles. She I loves Taz. Oh, sorry, Didi. Um, Gerald. Gerald. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, Christmas. Decorating something without. Yeah, well, yeah. It wasn't really planned, and I bought. I spent forty quid on Christmas decks. So on the market, I got these incenses. So we love incense in this house, and mm, so I've got. Amazing here, I can vouch for that. Yeah, and we've got coconut. We've got that one, and my boyfriend really loves the dragons. Well, I said it was. Dra he said it was dragon's breath, well, but but this blood? is dragon's blood. I prefer the dragon's breath. That makes more sense as it being an incense. Blood. You know what yeah. I mean? But what was the, yeah, but what if, yeah, but what if the dragon had a really stingy breath? You know? <laughs> what would like, you, dying I, flesh. It would be just like, yeah, just flesh, isn't it? But I got for myself Ooh. this. Okay, so I was telling Marika about this brand, mm. St. Ivel. And I've said it on this channel so many times, right? Mm. So this is one of the best candle brands I've ever come across and I like a variety of candles you know I like my bougie candles I like my spinny candles but this is so good and the price 13.85 how many burning hours do you get with this this is 45 hours yeah, that's pretty good. and this one is uplifting aromatic spices nutmeg cinnamon and cloves because I was like I really want a Christmas. just smell that mm. it literally smells of um Christmassy potpourri that oh, is it is, that is, it's so good. Mm. That takes me back to my childhood, that yes, real bad. Yes, it does actually, it's very yeah, nostalgic. it is nostalgic. And um, we're about to go out for dinner. Mm. Oh my god. 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 Oh my god, so much chicken today. <laughs> so good. Oh, really? Oh, there's one. Don't want to be. Wanna be. Oh. <laughs> An Emma! <laughs> one halloumi, no, two halloumi layers. What are we going to do? Good morning, Saturday. And I've brought the troops to boot camp with me. Marika really wanted to come to my boot camp because I've, I've, I've talked about her about it before in the past. 
So she was like, can we go to your boot camp? So I was like, yeah. So I brought her and the boy for long. And uh, then we're gonna go for a really nice long walk at the coast. So it's quite an active day today. How are you finding boot camp? Amazing. We've done the second round now. I think we did three or four. Three. Three. I think it's awesome. I feel amazing. It's the top, the first one, the first round is tough. Yeah. But with this shirt, I feel the best. We're gonna go get coffee now yeah. from. Um, that was my motivation. Not yeah. Gonna lie. Red sauce. Get a nice coffee from Red Sauce. Yeah, just the food. Dane and her Danish. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a pastry and a little quiche, mm. which I'm gonna put in my backpack for our walk. Oh, I should. Oh well. Oh well. My friend's husband is in there as well. I just took a picture of him and sent it to her. <laughs> Caught out. <laughs> I ordered the raspberry and pistachio pastry. Um, I've, I'll, I have eaten most of it, but I am dipping it in my coffee and this is... I haven't ordered this before because I always get scared of pistachios after having pistachio ice cream in Crete when I was six years old and it's scarring me for life because it was awful. But this is so good. Mmm, I love dipping pastries into things. Mm. Right. But the pistachio and the raspberry, oh my god. We've made it to Wells. We've made it to Wells. We've made it to Wells. Diane's crying because she's a baby dog. Here we go. Into the woods. I forgot to put, I forgot to put my bloody walking shoes on, so I've got my gym trainers on still. Go on, girls. We just had a little photo shoot on the by the What does it say on yours? Because mine, mine says, my watch paused for a bit. Mine says we've done ten, exactly ten kilometers. Oh, does it? Look. You've done ten kilometers. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, because mine says eight point seven. But then, but look, it like missed out that whole. Oh yeah. <laughs> look, it missed out so missed out this whole bit oh, here. We definitely did ten then. Mine says exactly. How satisfying is that? Exactly ten. Yeah, that is. Fish and cheese. Oh, I'm just going to put my chair back a little bit. Hang on. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my pickle. Can I have my pickle, yeah. please? Uh-huh. <laughs> right, right. Here we go. <laughs> Cheers. Oh. Mm. Uh. Mm. We just got back. I've had a quick shower. <laughs> my match, my tracksuit on. <sighs> Beautiful. Don't know what I'm going to do now. Oh no, I don't, we're going to watch Twilight. We're going to chill this evening, watch Twilight. Tesco, Esco, extra, ex, yeah. Esco, extra, extra, extra. <laughs> Getting good stuff. We're, we're we're pinnacle of fashion right now. <laughs> yes. Oh, you look cool. I mean, yeah, I look like no. a hot mess. Look at me. Oh, yeah. no, no, you Got up a crack like there. Hot. And I'm a mess. No, <laughs> I'm the mess. You're the hat. Vlogs. I don't know how long it's going to last. Yes. Actually lighting a fire is quite expensive these days. And I'll put a log on it as well. Get the bitch going. <laughs> Whoa, my swanky matches and they're actually pretty nice and warm.